Some people picked uh, you know, North Carolina with they had, well, they had more first place votes, so probably realistically we're probably even considered fourth or, you know, from that standpoint. But uh, in, in the past we've had some strong defenses, and I think that's given us some credibility going into those votes a little bit. But uh, you know, anyway, we've got a you know we've got an untested defense in a lot of places, especially up front. And um, you know we've we've got a lot of work to do. But uh, the big thing I, I think we're talented. Uh, but at the same time, uh, I, I mentioned to the kids, I said, the big reason is they don't know who you are. And so hopefully we're going to practice with that mentality and that chip on our shoulder. And, but obviously, get better, play within our, their position, play you know what the defense demands, and, and continue to grow. And, uh, and I like where we started yesterday. It's just a starting point. Um, you know, but we've got to do it every day. Defense, it seems like a lot of the guys feel like people just don't know who they are yet. Uh, is that kind of the mentality that you guys are taking into this camp? Yeah, yeah, and it's a, you know, you got guys that have, you know, never played, you know, significant roles. You know, obviously, I'm talking Nigel Williams, I'm talking Benny Mahota, you know, the uh, Seth Dooley, Dwayne Alford's been here. You know, those guys certainly, um, you know, they, they haven't played a lot from scrimmage, so. Um, you know, I think just be hungry and go to work every day and uh, keep getting better, you know, keep getting better. But uh, you know, that's been our approach anyway. There's a lot of hype on this there. Um, two corners being back, two safeties have played together for three years. Do you embrace that? Do you like all the buzz around these guys? Or do you try to humble them? I keep them humble, keep it in perspective. Um, I guess it's nice to be talked about and be in certain discussions, but at the same time, our expectation, I tell them every year, is to be one of the top secondary in the country. Be one of Talk defense in the country, so that's nothing new. It's just right now people expect us to go out and do it, so that shouldn't be anything different from us. You do have to feel good, right, about the four guys. I mean, when you look at the lineup you're putting out there in opening day, and I know you've dealt with injuries all the last few years. When you look at those four guys, you gotta feel good. I tell you what, I felt real good last year. We never got anybody at the same time, so if we can get everybody out there at the same time, I feel great. I really do. But you know, hopefully that will be the case. Defensively, obviously. At the secondary attack, but everybody else is kind of being replaced with yeah. seven seniors. Uh, a couple of the guys mentioned that people don't know who you guys are. Do you feel like that's kind of the case, and that once people get to know who you guys are, they don't realize you guys are pretty good? Yeah, that nobody really knows who we are. Everybody's kind of gotten us out of ready, but um, we got a lot of young, hungry guys. Some guys who have some experience on special teams and plays here and there, but um, uh, you can definitely tell what type of attitude are, like all these guys are approaching camp with and, you know, trying to uh, get that starting spot. So, you know, and that's exciting to see as an older guy, I guess, uh, not to be him. Um, so, yeah, you know, they can count us out as long as they want to. Uh, you know, we're just going to game one, game two. That's just how we got to do it. Is there more pressure on you and Brandon because you don't have Kyle and Anton around? There are other guys they could put in, and, and now you don't really have that. I wouldn't say pressure. You know, both of us are ready for the challenge. You know, we had a challenge last year, you know, not knowing that we was going to play as much as we did. And, you know, I think both of us are just excited for the opportunity, knowing that, you know, we're the guys now, you know. You know, Coach Foster and Coach Gray, when making plays in the secondary, along with Bonner and Kyle, you know, they're going to be looking at us now.